Hello, Storm Caroline. The third name storm of the season arrives on Thursday, bringing disruptive, even damaging winds to northern parts of Britain. Yellow and an amber warning are in force. For all the latest details, please visit the Met Office website. Ahead of Storm Caroline, well, Wednesday's a blustery night for everyone. A lot of cloud cover and increasingly spells of wet weather spreading from west to east across the country. Accompanying the rain, gusty winds and the winds changing direction in the northwest by the end of the night, bringing colder temperatures. But for most, it is a mild night. However, let's focus in on the north because here in the cold air that arrives by Thursday morning, Storm Caroline hits and we're expecting widespread gales for Scotland and parts of Northern Ireland with exposed locations seeing gusts of 60, 70, 80 miles an hour. Now, those kinds of gusts could cause disruption to transport and to power supplies. A yellow warning is in force for parts of Scotland and Northern Ireland. But for the north of Scotland during Thursday, we are expecting gusts in exposed locations of 90 miles an hour. And those kinds of gusts can cause damage and they can cause flying debris. An amber warning in force here. The strongest winds moving from the west to the east through the day and cold air digs in behind, leading to these showers that form increasingly to fall as sleet and snow. But across England and Wales, it's a mild start to Thursday. A lot of cloud and, for a time, some wet weather. However, the strong winds quickly push the cloud and the rain away and replace it with sunny skies. Although in that sunshine, it's still going to feel pretty brisk with these strong winds digging in behind and cold air. We'll start the day in the south, 12 or 13 degrees. We finish it 6 or 7 degrees. Now, if you follow the isobars all the way back, from Storm Caroline, well, they come from the Arctic. That's where our air will be coming from later Thursday and into Friday. It could be the coldest air of the season so far. Cold enough for virtually the whole country, for anything coming out of the sky, to fall as snow. Any snowfall, though, will be coming in the form of showers, and that means they'll be very hit and miss. It's northern and western parts of Britain during Friday that will see the thickest and the fastest showers coming through, and it will quickly build up over the Scottish mountains, northern Irish mountains and Welsh mountains, 10 to 20 centimetres in places. But even at lower levels, for northern and western parts of Britain, we could see 2 to 5 centimetres of snow building up. But because they are showers, it will be hit and miss. Eastern areas well sheltered. The odd flake of snow here and there, but also a good deal of sunshine. However, whatever weather you have, it is going to feel very cold. Two or three degrees at best in some places, feeling even colder in the wind and, of course, where the snow comes through. Weather warning still in force on Friday for wind in the north and for snow for northern and western parts of Britain. For all the latest details on our forecasts and our weather warnings, please visit the Met Office website, Met Office app, and keep up to date via the Met Office social media channels.